Okay, I'm here. So, hello everyone. I just want to talk to you guys really fast because it's kind of late and I actually forgot to record earlier today. Uh, today, I really couldn't decide what I wanted to do from when it got to around 7 to 6, or 6 to 7 or something like that. I really couldn't, so I just played Halo 4 and then I jumped onto uh, Halo Reach because uh, I was invited to play with uh, Boss Plays. Uh, Dano the Dinosaur and Noble Trickett. Because they noticed I play Halo a lot and I was also telling them, hey, I know you got Halo 3, but maybe because of the free Xbox Live Go membership thing, but I don't know. And, uh, you know, I'm experienced with it and I blah, blah, blah. So I played with them and I had a really good time and stuff, so that's really great. Uh,. I can't tell you if they're all Let's Players, but I can tell you Boss Plays is. Go check his out. Go check his channel out. He's pretty good at it. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm a little tired. Uh, for the rest of the morning, I guess I could say, I just kind of did nothing. I don't really think I did anything at all. I can't remember what I really did. But it's probably nothing even important. Probably like, oh, eat, watch some YouTube videos, and that was about it. And then, uh, the daytime, I mostly just, this is what I did all evening. I just watched TV. I just watched Fairy Tale. Uh, they got more episodes of, uh, Raising Hope, which I really liked. Uh, because I, I seen all of them before, but they just added new ones to Netflix. But they're not really new because I seen it before on Hulu Plus when I was borrowing my friend's Hulu Plus. But anyways, uh, saw new episodes of that. And, uh, what else was there? I... Oh yeah, I saw, uh, for the first time, because I said to myself, if I don't start watching some of these shows on Netflix, I need to watch them, because they're eventually going to go away. And that's just my one downside on myself. Like, that's myself. I hate me for this reason. Is that I can't decide what I want to do. If I want to play a game, I can't decide or that, or another game. Or another game, or another game. And the same thing goes with the shows. So today I watched the movie Full Metal Alchemist, the star, the, the sacred star of Milos or Milos. Pretty sure it was Milos. Uh, that was a, it, it was not too great what I thought of it. It was, but for what it was, it was great. Uh, yeah, I just said it backwards, but differently. Um, I mean, the show. I could say it's ten times better than that, but the thing is, the movie was okay, but not the greatest thing. But I do like how they tell you that for the first time in the actual original anime, Full Metal Alchemist, not the Brotherhood one, but just the original, because it's actually for the original, uh, they tell you they're actually out of Menstri- uh, uh, Menstens? Men Men Where they're from. You know, the area, you know, all of Menstens, whatever the place is called, I forgot what it's called right now. And, uh, I thought it was really brilliant how they pulled it off and all that stuff. And there was like sometimes here and there, I literally thought I was watching probably like a movie from the Brotherhood series. But I kept thinking, no, because this and that happened. And I know that this is different than that. And the other ones, like, okay, never mind. So, like, stuff like that, I kind of realized that. So, it's a good thing I knowing the prof and pros, the pros and cons, I should say, of uh, Fullman Alchemist and Fullman Alchemist Brotherhood. But, uh, yeah. Um, I just didn't really done today much, so, uh, I just wanted to tell you guys that, and, uh, yeah, I mostly saw a lot of episodes of, uh, Fairy Tale because, uh, uh, lots of things were happening, and I didn't want to stop until I got to an episode that actually stopped telling me things, other than telling me in the next episode, I was like, oh, God. So, uh, I barely learned that Loki or Leon, I guess you could say, is a celestial a celestial spirit and stuff like that. So I learned stuff like that. I thought it was pretty, you know, stuff like pretty cool and stuff like that. It's like, oh, oh man, it's so sad of what happened to his previous owner and all that stuff. But the thing is, like, uh, the thing is, on all these episodes are making me actually kind of like cry, like you know, emotional. Which uh, a lot of animes can't do that. I mean, they can, but a lot of them don't literally want to do that. Like. I've seen lots of animes that, <clears throat> sorry, did they try and they pulled off pretty well, but not too much well. Uh, that actually makes me want to like tear up. 
makes you want to like emotionally, you know, feel bad for him or her, but not uh, like tear up. Now, I gotta say, Fairy Tale's been doing a really good job with this, so I just gotta say, terrific, terrific job. Uh, sad thing is, I only have like maybe 12, 14 episodes left of Fairy Tale Season 1, which kind of makes me bummed out because don't want to stop, but I'm, I know that fairy tale is still continuing in Japan, so I, I know I have to eventually stop watching for a while. That or I don't know if season two is already out because I know this whole entire season is only season one. And it's like forty-eight episodes or something like that. And that's a lot. Uh, so I thought it was pretty amazing. Uh, so far, I'm only on like episode like th what I don't know thirty, thirty maybe exactly. I don't know, but I know it's like 48. But anyways, uh, like I said, I don't really remember how much I have watched left, but I know I have a couple left. Uh, like, above 30, for sure. Uh, but, uh, yeah, today has just been really a watch TV kind of day. But I really need to get back to playing some of these games. Yeah, just because... Well, the thing is, I just can't decide. I'm just a guy that can't decide if I want to watch shows or play games. Me, in my head, I'm thinking I should watch the shows because on Netflix, I know shows eventually go away. I know they do. Movies and shows all eventually go away and then come back whenever they want to. Weird stuff. I don't know. Netflix. And I can play all these games whenever I want. Whenever I want. So, in my, in my head, I want to do like a marathon of shows and movies I've never seen before. And just finish them before they go away or something like that on Netflix. Now, there's no really best way to indicate you that they're going away. But the best way there is is that if you actually go on the website for Netflix and sign in. And it's the shows that you picked. It's on your, like, your My List or My Instant Queue or something like that. It shows you when they're leaving or they're just going to stay there for as long as they can. Or, or it's like, oh, this show is about to get off instant, uh, instant streaming and like. A month or two. It was like, oh god, I better start watching that. Until it goes away. Stuff like that. But I kind of wish they did that the same thing on like the actual streaming apps. As in, you know, like the Wii U, Wii, 3DS, Vita, uh, 360, Xbox One, uh, PS4, PS3, and all that other stuff. I mean, I wish, I wish they kind of, you know, told us like that. Oh, and also Androids, phones, Nooks, all that other shit. Kendall. Uh, but, I mean, I kind of wish they kind of told us not other than just going to the website all the time. Which, yeah. Uh, so that's about it. I just wanted to tell you that I mostly watch TV shows for the whole day, most likely. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, that's really it. So anyways, uh, I guess I'll just see you guys all for tomorrow's episode because I just didn't have much to say. And plus... I did watch a Pacific episode. A lot of people have been telling me on Twitter, on Shadow Nights of Rex, which is okay. It's okay. Uh, it took me like three days to see that tweet. Three people literally told me, which is weird. Uh, apparently, there's a fairy tale cross rave master episode, which I have to see. Which uh, I never really seen rave master. I mean, I remember the show. But I don't remember it, like, completely. I don't know any of the names. I don't know anybody. I don't know anything. Other than one little thing that kind of made me... Con I realized that this show is somehow connected to Fairy Tale is Plue. The little dog-like no nose cone white thing. That thing. All I know it's called is Blue. That's it. Like, I knew that was also on Rave Master. So, uh, I watched the episode. I uh, thank God it was English, uh, not dubbed, but English subbed. And thank God I, you know, watched it. That's actually pretty good. And it made me notice some things I didn't notice before or never wouldn't have noticed if I didn't see it. So, yeah. Uh, now I'm actually wanting to watch Rave Master, which is really weird because it's a show I seen, but I never really got into. And now it's a show I really want to watch. And it's probably going to be maybe. Easy to find, but hard to find, but I don't know. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment below. And I'll see you guys for tomorrow's vlog, which I might talk to you about more shows I want to watch. But I'm going to give you my final review on that episode I saw, Fairy Tale Cross Rave Master. I'm going to give it 
an 8 out of 10 because Lucy did like nothing. <laughs> Lucy did like nothing. And for me, it did spoil a little bit of stuff just because it's, well, I'm not that far in some season 1, but still pretty good. And um, from what I'm liking of it, it's pretty good. But anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys for then, alright? Deuces.